and soothing but her voice was so big and you know even that young her presence was just just jumped out I think so many of the great performers had a specialty with Judy Garland it was the singing and she was a bloody good actress as well the song that defines the Wizard of Oz for many people is Over the Rainbow and the bizarre thing is that was originally going to be cut from the film. It would have been a tragedy because the importance of those black and white scenes at the start and the end of the film is they give this kind of real sadness to the film. You can imagine for an audience not used to colour, that bit where Dorothy walks out into Oz for the first time and the screen is absolutely flooded with colour must have been an amazing experience that perhaps we don't quite uh, relish or understand enough today. It wasn't a hit when it was first released. Um, it, it was not a big success. It was only with subsequent generations getting to see it on television and then video and DVD that it, it's taken on this, this enormous uh, afterlife. Follow the yellow brick road. I save it up. I will only watch it every three years because it is such a treat to myself to sit down and watch it. You have to see the wizard, the wonderful wizard of Oz. You find the end of the wizard of Oz, if ever a wizard of Oz, if ever a wizard of Oz, the wizard of Oz is one because, 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 because of the wonderful things he does. We're off to see the wizard, the wonderful wizard of Oz. There's not anybody between the age of three and 83 who doesn't completely understand every frame of that movie. It's just completely timeless. With the thoughts you'd be thinking you could be another Lincoln if you only had a brain. Musicals are the greatest form of entertainment that the Western world has conceived to this day because they are a place where there are no restrictions. Why, if our scarecrow back in Kansas could do that, the crows would be scared to pieces. I think Judy Garland became a huge gay icon because um, she was such a tortured soul. A lot of gay men have got this very sort of almost dramatic uh, part of themselves and she fills that for them. When other kids in the school round, they wanted to be like the lion or the tin man. I was quite happy to click those heels and be whisked off somewhere fabulous. Judy Garland was a force of nature. And uh, I gave a lot of thought to why these women died so young. They couldn't survive this pressure of the picture business. It's so strange when people of such enormous talent get picked on to die when there's so many bums around <laughs> that are still alive. I, no, that really upset me when Judy died. And I'm not going to leave here ever, ever again because I love you all. Oh, Annie M. There's no place like home. The Wizard of Oz, I think, is, you know, many people's favourite musical. And I think it's because of Judy Garland's central performance. But the true horror behind that story is the fact that it nearly went to Shirley Temple. And I think if Shirley Temple had played Dorothy in The Wizard of Oz, it would have been a, a nightmare of kind of unbelievable proportions. And I don't think we'd regard it as the great musical that we do today.